Circle geometry you learn in grade 11, but the parts of the circle we can already use now. You can see that the information that is given is O is the center of the circle. AO is given as parallel to QR, right? Uh, PA is equals to AQ and PB is equals to BT. Now, because we have, if you look at this triangle PQR, we can already see that PO would be equal to OR, midpoint theorem. And now that I have PO equal to OR, I can say that OB is parallel to RT. So here's the first question. It says, prove that AB is parallel to QT. Okay. So prove AB is parallel to QT. And the way we solve it, as we say, in triangle P, Q, T. Now look carefully what is happening. Um, a, B is this line. And Q, T is that line. All right. And it forms part of this triangle. Okay. So now that it's part of this triangle, I can see that these pairs of lines are equal to each other. Therefore, this line is parallel to that one. So we say um, PA is equals to AQ and uh, PB is equals to BT. That information is given. Therefore, AB is parallel to QT and the reason is midpoint theorem. And that is it. Short, sweet, simple. The next question is prove that O, that O, is the center of the circle if PR is the diameter. So they say that PR is the diameter, and now you need to prove that that's the center of the circle. It's very simple to prove that um, because we're going to look at triangle PQR. Okay. Cool. So let me show you how to write it. Um, we say that in triangle PQR, what we have is PA is equal to a Q and a O is equal to Q R that is given. Therefore, P O is equals to O R. And the reason or what we are using is the midpoint theorem. All right. And therefore, O is the center. Because um, that line, PO equals to OR, is the diameter. And because it's cut in half, that means PO represents the radius and OR also represents the radius, which makes that the, the center. So what we have proven now is um, we have added these lines equal to each other. All right. The last question is prove that BORT is a trapezium. All right. What you need to prove with a trapezium is that one pair of lines or one set of lines are parallel. So we already have PB equal to BT and we have uh, PO equal to RT. Therefore, OB is parallel to RT, midpoint theorem. And therefore, that is a parallelogram. Easy way to write it is we say PO is equals to OR proven.
It's not given. We proved it in the previous question. Then PB is equals to BT. That information is given. Therefore, OB is parallel to RT. What you've proven is the midpoint theorem, or what you're using. Therefore, BO RT is a trapezium because one pair of sides is parallel.